Start us off, we have Big Baby and the Auntie versus the two man power trip Drake Awesome and Tyler Mack. Then we'll see one half of the tag team champions, Antonio Campbell against Bannon. Big Country takes on Slimmy Jimmy. Eric Allen and Ross Cummings. Ross Cummings still looking for a Good singles victory. Maybe he can get his luck going tonight. And then a fatal four-way. Jelly Bean Bandit. Magical Harry Caldwell. Aiden Perez. And Randy Hughes. Then we have some more tag team action. We have the totally beautiful duo. Versus the Disciples of Darkness. We have Jackie Martinez going against one half of our women's tag team champions, Tia Brown. Hardcore action as Owen Steele goes one-on-one -on -one with Mr. Amazing. Mr. Amazing defends his hardcore title with our special ref, of course, the legendary Mick Foley. And then finally, in our main event, we have the women's world champion, Omega Fisher, going one-on-one -on -one against Maya Jones. From the Misfit Circus. All right, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's start the action. Uh, sorry, let's get to the main event. his way down and not far behind I would imagine is that incredible woman known as the auntie All right, Auntie making her way. Taking the stage, 
Drake's got the strength, Tyler's ready to engage. Awesome five drops, feel the thunder roar. Mac attack hits, crowd begging for more. VCW, a time to respect our name. Management tripping, we ain't playing no games. It's a statement in the ring, we ain't here to chill. Feel the heat, feel the power, this is real. Kill from the bottom to the top, we rose like flames. DCWA trying to tame us, we change the game. In the locker room, one thing, we rule this land. Every hit, every slam, they don't understand. Two man power trip, we won't be denied. Feel the awesome oh, five rocks to Mac and 54 No more Two limits, man. no more chains. All right, the two-man power trip. And last we saw Drake and Tyler Mack. They were looking to beat down Mr. Amazing with chairs after Drake Awesome won his match against Keith Miller. But Ross Cummings came down and made the save. And Big Baby and Aji just recently competed for the tag team titles. Unfortunately, they came up short. All right, Big Baby and Drake to start us off. Big Baby into the corner. Back elbows by Drake, awesome. Slamming the arm on the mat. Dropping the elbow across the chest. Drake Awesome is taking it to Big Baby Star us off. Oh, wait a minute, reversal. Big Baby now turns his attention to Tyler Mack. Oh, and what a bulldog by Big Baby. Into the corner where Auntie awaits. Oh, it's him right in the eyes. Big Baby now has him in the bear hug. Drake Awesome fighting out. Uh, Monday morning show is only on YouTube. And uh, it is just basically to help jobbers along to try to get some momentum. Tyler Mack taking baby into the corner. I gotta fix it because it's listed on my Twitch schedule, but it's not actually on Twitch. All right. Big Baby grasps from behind, but Tyler Mack with an elbow to the head. Looks so like he went for that bear hug again. But Tyler Mack did not allow that to happen. Tyler Mack now sends him into the corner. We'll see our first tag team maneuver of the day. Ooh, big punch to the gut. Drake just a lot of unanswered strikes into a neck breaker. Nicely done. Big Baby was trying to get the hot tag going, but Drake cut it off. Oh, reversal by Big Baby. Oh, what a splash in the corner. Tag to Auntie. Oh, Drake back up. Auntie sending him into the corner. Tag is made. Let's see what they got planned here. Lifts Drake up. Oh, double axe head right across the back. Big baby now. Oh my God, he's about to drop that sticky load. One, two. Tyler Mack with the save. Big Baby with the deadlift, sit out, power bomb. Showing that 40 year old toddler strength. Into the corner, tag is made. Only arm out. Auntie dropping the double axe handle, causing the damage. Off the ropes, but no, Drake stops whatever that went. Oh boy, has, it, her, has her up. Brings her in their own corner. Dropping the snake eyes. 
Oh, that looked a little low with that kick from Ati. Oh, and a bit slap to Ati. Now hit there with the back elbows. Into the pin. One. Only a one count as Ati kicks out. Oh boy, looks like they're going for their finisher here. And there it is, pitch a perfect drop kick and the suplex into the pin, but Baby's right there. Yeah, we're not even gonna get a one count. Ani smart to roll out of the ring. Tyler Mack angry at Big Baby, but oh, Baby was ready. Oh, Auntie telling them to kiss it, and the crowd cheers. I guess some people in the crowd really want to kiss Auntie's booty. She is bootylicious. Here we go, Auntie now. Power bomb with some extra mustard on it. Tyler Mack going for the hot tag. Big Baby get in there. Will he stop it in time? No, Drake is in. Drake and Baby fresh. Drake is going up. Oh, dropping the splash. One, two, and a kick out. A stop to the gut. Tag back in to Tyler Mack. Quick tags. That's a key here. Oh, Big Baby with the roll up. What? No. Wow. Tried to steal that one. Good old neck crank. Tyler Mack, rolling to the outside. Maybe he was gonna tag, but decides he wants to give Drake a little piece of his mind here. Rub kicks him off the corner. Tyler Mack sends him for the ride into the other corner. What does he have planned for Big Baby here? Oh my goodness. And that is a neck breaker and a half, ladies and gentlemen. Into the pin. One, two. Oh, Auntie stops the count and takes out the ref. Big Baby with the body splash. But no ref, so he doesn't bother going for the pin. Tyler Mack bringing the punishment back into the corner. Tag is made. Oh, it's Drake's turn. Oh, there we go. Almost as good of a drop kick as Tyler Mack himself into the pin. One, two, three. There you have it. Ani checking on Big Baby. Wait a minute. Oh, well, they weren't successful with the chair attack on Mr. Amazing and Mr. Magnificent, but they are accomplishing their goal of causing destruction here tonight in a great match. Drake Awesome and Tyler Mack won their match against Big Baby and Nani and delivered a brutal beating to their opponents. The crowd roared and booed in frustration, hoping that these superstars will get what they deserve. And ladies and gentlemen, I have just received word that Big Baby and Auntie are gonna team up with Mr. Amazing and Mr. Magnificent on the 25th at August Anarchy War Games in a War Games match, four on four, with an un another tag team of Tyler Mack and Drake Austin's choosing. They will be going to war. 
in the Sunday after this one. Now let's take it to the next match. Oh, a handshake to start us off here. Oh, but Bannon doesn't want any part of it. Really getting under the skin of the tag team champion, Antonio. And a clothesline by Antonio, and now dropping the fist. Throwing Bannon onto the ropes. And then tosses him back in the hard way. Oh, small package. Kind of reminds me of people that shop at Market Basket. Right, just having his way with Ben in here. Oh, looking to cause damage that knee into the pin here. Just a one count. Not surprising, that's not really a move you finish a match with. Oh, Antonio has him up. Dropping the snake eyes in the corner. A good old stomp to the face. Up to the back of the head. Oh my gosh. Oh God! That's like a meteor strike. Coming off that top rope. Oh! Then him back up. Knee to the gut. Tony just shoves him off. A real one-sided affair after that slap to the face by Bannon. Elbow. Bannon now, and that is about as beautiful as a DDT as they get. Look at the muscles on that man. Beautiful arms. Oh, and Antonio's getting fired up. Spinebuster into the pin. One, two, not quite the three. <laughs> Off the ropes. Oh, misses with the big boot. Hit it now. A sit out last ride powerbomb into the pin. Oh, but they're in the ropes. Lucky for Antonio there. Has him by the throat. Oh! Into the corner, clothesline, hits it Mark, but he's not done. Coming back in, into the gut. He's still not done. Now just beating down this mountain of a man. Trying to break some fingers there. Into the corner, elbow to the face. Then it covers the eyes with that variation of the spine buster. And now lifts him up, the deadlift. Oh boy. Oh, and that could be it there, into the pin. One, two, oh my gosh! Then it's showing the frustration.
Now we head to the outside. Oh, he runs into a massive clothesline. We got a fight on the outside, ladies and gentlemen. Gouges the eyes. We're up to a count of four. This continues to beat down our tag team champion. Up to a count of five, the ref telling him to get back in the ring. All right, we are heading back into the ring. Oh, he misses trying to take out the leg there. With the chop block. That's man it up. Ref, get out of the way. Ref almost gets it in the corner there. Oh, and Bannon is busted open. Not that you really be see, able to see it behind the mask, but he is certainly feeling the abuse here. Oh, off the ropes! And that's, that's gonna be it. He flattened that damn man. One, two, three. Well, you gotta give it to him. The family is a group of some tough sons of a bitches. They come in threes, the family you see. Anthony the boss, don't cross his decree. Antonio, big man. Antonio Campbell tried disrespecting his opponent with a fake handshake before the match could start pulling his hand away. Oh, so he pulled his hand away. That's why he got slapped. Bannon responded with a humiliating slap to the face, not falling easily for such an old trick. And that, in my opinion, was a great match. Up next, big country, let me Jimmy. These are two of our lowest rated superstars behind, besides Rod coming. So there should be a very comparable match. They're both about a 75.
And, uh, and, uh, uh, a beautiful, uh, I mean, uh, I don't know what to call that. That's about as good of a song as that Australian woman is at breakdancing at Olympics. Oh, and he's not letting Slimmy Jimmy finish his entrance here. He wants a piece of Slimmy Jimmy right away. Oh, and he is taking it, the poor boy. Well, you know what? When you're not performing up to your standards and you need to get in that limelight, what better way than to really push the envelope? And that's what Big Country's doing here tonight with very on sportsmanlike conduct. The Slimmy Jimmy trying his best to fight back. They gotta get this back in the ring though, or the ref's gonna call it. Slimmy Jimmy sent them in. There we go, the match is now official. You gotta wonder if the attack on the outside is already. Um, Okay, there we go. I was like, they both had a brain fart there for a minute. DDT, Slimmy Jimmy telling him to suck his meat stick. Suck my Slim Jim, bitch! Who drop kick, but big country right back up. Off the ropes. Beautiful spine buster. Slimmy Jimmy slowly getting to his feet. Big country's got him up. Now off the turnbuckle. Oh, but Slimmy Jimmy continues to fight back from underneath. Oh, that headbutt had to have hurt. Oh, that back elbow! And Slimmy Jimmy is a bloody mess, but he will not let that deter him. One! Now we are back on the outside. Cobra Clutch Slam! He's gonna break this poor boy in half! Off the apron, just trying to force that cut open a little bit more. Slimmy Jimmy is resilient. We're up to a count of four. <laughs> Leaves Slimmy Jimmy out like a piece of trash. Let the crowd know what he's gonna do to Slimmy Jimmy next. Breaks the ref's count. He wants Slimmy Jimmy to follow him back into the ring. He is taunting and that's gonna cost him. Slimmy Jimmy with a neck breaker, dropping the elbow. Oh, are we getting fired up, Slimmy Jimmy? We getting that meat stick madness? Slimmy Jimmy now going up. The country slowly getting to his feet. Oh, and he misses wildly. Best believe Big Country makes him pay for it. One, two. Oh, that was almost a knockout shot. Oh, really trying to bust that cut open even more. Slimmy Jimmy now, use those educated feet. Oh, 
Trying to take out those massive arms on Big Country. Oh, with the reversal. Oh, no, Slimmy Jimmy moves. We're up to five, ladies and gentlemen. And there's a running Bulldog, and now he's returned the favor. Big Country's busted open. And Slimmy Jimmy knows a win's a win. He's looking to take the count. No, he sees Big Country getting up. Reversal. Big Country sends him towards the entrance ramp. See that cut on the side of Big Country's head. Here we go into the corner now. Laying waste with those fists to the face. Stomping on the arm into the pin. One, two. Slimmy Jimmy gets the rope break. He grabs the rope. And luckily the ref saw it. Oh, and Big Country is making him pay. Jimmy continues to fight back. Oh, hits him with the backbreaker. He's going up. Here we go. Oh, no. Crash and burn. Let me, Jimmy, trying to get himself together here. Oh, ho, ho. He might have took his jaw off there. And now Big Country going up. Oh, he, <laughs> oh my. He misses, but Slimmy Jimmy's still groggy. But Big Country is taking advantage. Slimmy Jimmy now back into the pit. One, two, three, and there you have it. Big Country rushed out Slimmy Jimmy before he could finish entrance to the match. Not waiting for the bell before taking the fight to his rival. And that was yet again another great match. And I'll tell you what, his plan to get the upper hand by attacking him before the match really paid off. Now with Eric Allen and Ross coming. Let's take it to the ring. with his dance. And I'm sure he's looking at Ross Cummings as an easy win tonight. And I'm sure Ross Cummings is hoping 
to show him wrong here tonight. And if you wanted to see how break dancing is done, Olympics, take note. We're, Eric Allen's about to show you how it's done. There you go. And his opponent from the internet, weighing in at 285 pounds, Mr. wants to remind you that he is not Ross Hancock. Ross Hancock went away when he got put in that casket. And Ross Hancock doesn't wear a mask, so he couldn't possibly be Ross Hancock. Coming 69! He's not Ross Hancock and me once, what's his? So here we go. Eric Allen starting us off here. Oh, but Ross Hancock with the reversal. Ducks under the punch. Into the corner. But Eric Allen fights out of there. Oh, running neck breaker. Eric Allen might have hit a little hard on that too because he was slow to get up. Oh, neck right over the top rope. Now coming off the ropes. Big splash, but Ross moves out of the way. And I do agree, our refs do definitely count slow at times. Oh, there we go. What a leg lariat. Ross showing off some of the new moves he's been working on. Trying to turn his fortune around. And he's biting the nose. Getting a little dirty. Oh, he's measuring him up. Oh. Now that biting. Here we go. Springboard leg drop. Taking some of the moves. He's learned fighting with Mr. Amazing. Eric Allen with another running neck breaker. Ooh, drop kick to the side of the head. Now working on the leg. And yet again, Ross begging for mercy. But relentlessly, Eric Allen, he's trying to innovate breaking legs here tonight. My God, well, this is the fifth time. Oh, and finally Ross kicks him off and you hear a fan yell, now we're talking. Ross has him up, the fans solidly behind him. Eric Allen, he's bleeding, baby. Oh, and he's looking to open up that cup more. Another running boot to the side of the head. Oh, Eric Allen catches leg, but oh no! Ross with the finesse. Eric Allen moves out of the way. Kick to the side of the head. Ross slow to get up. Eric Allen kick to the gut. Looking around, letting the crowd know he's hitting that DDT. Oh, runs him right into the ref. Ross catches the leg. Ref needs to learn how to stay out of the way. Oh, what's Ross planning here? Oh! Ref's gonna check that, that looks a little low. Into the pin. One, two, and a kick out by Eric Allen. Ross is taking control here. 
Yeah, keep that pressure on. He's up top, dropping the elbow. Oh, and he is looking to finish here. Well, he hit the magnificent CTE. Here he goes, and there it is, into the pin. One, one, two. Oh, the ref, yes, slow count, slow count. Fuck, pardon my friends. Kicking Ross off. Ross back up. Ross dodges. Oh, Eric Allen reverses. Misses with the clothesline. Oh, Ross with a gut buster. Eric Allen wisely pulls himself out of the ring. He needs a breather, but Ross ain't letting him have one. Into the pit again. One, two, and that was a solid count by the ref, I must say. Dropping the knee. Oh, walks right to a kick by Eric Allen. Eric Allen now stomping on the arm. Kick to the gut. We see another DT. no! Ross was ready this time. Oh, but Eric Allen, reversal for reversal. Dropping him with the snake eyes. Runs right into the ref, ref, stay out of the way. What are we paying you for? Oh, Eric Allen's going up. But Ross is right back up, Eric Allen thought better of it. In the corner, big close line, back elbow. Into the pin. One, two, three, and that's it. Here is your winner, the innovator, Eric Allen. Well, thanks for coming, Ross Cummings. All right, in my opinion, that was a great match. There was supposed to be a cut scene with Carter Storm, but you know, ah, fuck. Why would we bother? Why would the game bother to work right? Up next, Fatal 4-Way action. Let's take it to the ring.
Crowd really loves this wizard. We'll see if he can perform some magic here tonight and score a big victory. To be the first of his VCWA career. This is only his second match ever. this fatal four-way on. Harry taken down. Randy Hughes. And Jellybean Bandit into the pit. Oh, now Perez into the pit. But Harry breaking it up. Taking out Harry. As Perez and Randy goes at it. Oh, Jelly Bean got that swagger. Randy rolling to the outside. Oh, what a drop kick by Magical Harry. Randy looking for a weapon. He's found a sledgehammer. But he's also found a Jelly Bean Bandit out there. Has Jelly Bean up. Oh, and he takes out Randy as well. And Harry has a chair. To no avail. As Perez slams Jelly Bean onto the chair. Oh, the drop kick takes out both men. Be taking out Harry. Harry's right back up. Perez has the sledgehammer. Billy Bean. Oh, takes out Randy into the pin. Oh, but it's broken 
one up. Carry now. Oh, slaps press right on to the sledgehammer. Jelly Bean throwing Harry out of the ring. It's now Jelly Bean and Randy Hughes. Jelly Bean is looking on his game here tonight. Oh, Randy dumps Wisely gets out of the way of that sledgehammer. Oh, but walks right into a big boot. It's Harry and Perez fight on the outside. Randy has him up. Kelly Bean back up. Fight continues on the outside. Oh, that spin kick. Plus, Randy Hughes open. Oh, and Harry is feeling on the outside. Oh, but gets a spear. But right back up. Slam off the barricade. Randy Hughes now with the combo. Jelly Bean trying to get himself together. Oh, the deadlift by Perez. And Randy Hughes is stomping away at the face, coming off the ropes. Oh, that looked nasty. End of the pin. He could have it here. What? Oh, no, Perez is there. To break it up, and he's got a chair. Oh, Randy Hughes takes him out. Oh, and a nice drop kick by Jelly Bean. Randy Hughes goes to the outside. Oh, and Jelly Bean is busted open. And Harry has found his magic stick. He breaks it open. Now. Look at the back. Jelly Bean getting amped up. Randy Hughes coming over right into a big boot. Oh, Perez catches him, but no! Harry turns it into a bulldog. Now going up top as Jellybean looks for a weapon. There's a splash into the pit. One, two, Randy there to break it up. Jellybean misses. Oh, what a cutter. There goes Randy. And Perez, there he goes. Now it's just Jelly Bean and Harry in the ring. In the corner. Oh, with a big old chop across the chest now, trying to pull the arm out of the socket. Randy Hughes waiting for his opportunity. He hits it. Oh, both of the weapons. Randy Hughes is first to sledgehammer into the pin. One, two. Oh, and a kick out. Goes to trip. Perez ate it. Perez is ready. The ref in the way again. But he's wrestling so crack before the show. Ready to break up the pin. Oh, what a super kick by Randy. Now sneaking in. 
Raw Hunt takes him out with that disaster kick. Now, knee to the arm. Perez going up. There's the splash. He's got the sledgehammer. Oh, might have broke the rim. And now gives one to Randy Hughes as well. Harry back in there, breaking up the pitch. Oh, he catches up. It was figure four. Randy with the chair, he throws it at Jelly Bean Bandit. Harry has turned the pressure on him. Two, three, and that chair in the face. Randy Hughes with the big win. Walking over Jelly Bean Bandit. And what an amazing match. I don't think a tag team action is a totally beautiful duo. Take on the disciples of darkness. figure it out for you. I'll try to re-upload it uh, after the show if I remember. Yeah. 
Sons of Darkness. A very tough team to beat. But the totally beautiful duo are definitely no slouches in that ring. Death setting him in the corner to start us off. But I can't blame him. He doesn't want any part of that corner. Four with the cheap shot. Giving Death the advantage. Plan here. Oh! Trying to take out the arm. Obviously can't get the submission there because that is not a legal move. Now a knee breaker from death. He now looks to take out the arm. Dropping the fist. Oh man, he is trying to bust this boy open, I believe. Reversal into his own corner. And now it's oh, broken the life out of him. David Collins will play dirty if he needs to. The one now sends it in the corner. I thought he was gonna tag in Mighty Hooray, but apparently he still wants a bit more time with Death here. On the ropes now. Four ups to the back of the spine. Back into the corner, tag is made. As the arm. The gut. DDT into the pin. One. Only a one count. Moore was confident in his tag team partner there. Why he didn't come in. Oh, Demon. Trying to cause a distraction. Oh, and now, Death. Give him a little payback for what Jaden Collins said to him. The corner tag is made. Off the ropes. There's the big back body drop. Oh, and just stomping away with those cybernetic legs. of his cybernetic arms. You're so weak. <laughs> you hear the, you hear the, the, the crowd lays like, you're so weak. I <laughs> love it. Oh, it's some more choking going on. Allowed to make the save again. That's a by the throat. Oh. And Ryan getting a second win here. 
Back to Jaden Collins, and now the one. Oh, and War is in. Oh, and now Diva Matoda and Jaden Collins have a little discussion. This gives War the opening he needs. Is made off the ropes. Drop in the massive elbow. Goes to the hot tag but gets cut off. Oh boy, he's got him up. Pitcher perfect pile driver into the pit. What? Ryan Murray makes the save, which means he now will have a couple minutes before he's allowed back in the ring without a tag. That might have been a mistake by Ryan because they're about to finish it here. That cybernetic clothesline into the pin. One, two, oh my gosh. Four can't believe it. Jaden with the roll up. Nope. Shoves him off. Back into the corner. Blends the poor boy. Off the ropes. Does he have plan here? Oh, Jaden fighting back. Gets shoved off for his troubles. <laughs> oh, cheap shot. And call it now. Nope. Four. Puts him up on the shoulders. Across the ropes. Jaden back up. He runs straight to a brick wall. Back elbow to the face. Oh, what is his plan here? Got him up to the sidewalk slam. Nope, into a backbreaker. He's not done with just one. Gotta hit it with two. Into the pit. One, two, three. There you have it. Disciples of Darkness. God. <laughs> 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 this is 
sinus and thought that was, those loans were good. I don't know. I mean, they're good in some ways. I guess. In the pin. What? That's the one count. Oh, Tia Brown fighting back. Dropping the knees and then coming 
back again, and she's not done. Here we go. And it's fly. I don't know if shooting your shot on the outside, though, is the smartest move. You can't pin here. Maybe she's looking to cause harm. The crowd is loving it, though. Go up to a count of seven. Eight. Oh, boy. Kick to the face. She's going to steal it here. Outplayed. Count out victories. I love them. Woo! Nothing better than a count out victory. I will say, in this case, it was very smartly done by Tia Brown. I don't know what that nonsense is, but we don't need to read it because Carter Storm didn't even show up. All right, up next, hardcore title on the line. Mr. Amazing. Defense against Owen Steele. Owen Steele. Step up. The following contest is a special guest referee match and is for the Hardcore Championship. Please welcome the special guest referee for this match. And there he is, the hardcore legend himself. And yes, you heard it right. It's a custom theme song for McFoley. So there's no copyright. You know, playing it smart. Representing the red, white, and blue, as he proudly did in his military service. Owen Steele and Mr. Amazing are both rated above 80. This should be a pretty close match. He won this off of Tyler Mack. Just a little continuation of their feud.
is the hardcore title. I wish they could fix the graphics so it wouldn't be so shitty Pitch in the screen, the but from Great Falls, Montana, weighing in at 230 pounds, the Violator Owen Steele, and his opponent from Concord, New Hampshire, weighing in at 215 pounds, the Hardcore Champion. Look at that! Looks beautiful on his arms. You gotta hand it over to Mick Foley, who is hoping will hand it back after this match. And the crowd is very excited for this hardcore competition. Both men look ready. Oh, it's still coming out with the strikes to start us off. Oh, catches the legs of amazing. Oh my goodness, that is quite the combo. In the pin here. One, two, already a two count, not looking good for Mr. Amazing. Kick to the face. Now pounding away. You know, he's gonna hit him with that patented slap to the face, there it is. Owen Steele with the jawbreaker. Close line. Owen Steele going up. Oh my God, what a DDT! <laughs> Mr. Amazing coming back here now. Kicks the leg, sends him into the barricade. Oh, what's Mr. Amazing looking for here? He's got the barbed wire baseball bat. Now lights him, oh, and he busts it over the stomach of Mr. Amazing. That looked painful. Mr. Amazing trying to roll out of the way, but here's the pin. One, two, and a kick out. Hear the crowd, yeah, hit him again. Mr. Amazing with the dragon screw. But a jawbreaker yet again by Owen Steele. On the ropes now. What's that plan for him here? Oh, leave him out to dry into the pit. One, two. Still powers out. Nick Foley's better than our regular refs. Into the corner. Mr. Amazing now, bringing the shoulders deep into the gut. Oh, and he's got that barbed wire baseball bat again. One of Mick Foley's favorite things. Oh boy. And he is not playing around, ladies and gentlemen. What still has the arm? He's bringing it down. Oh, that angle did not look good on his arm. I think they're saying snap his fingers. Oh, now he's got the barbed wire baseball bat. Mr. Mason rolls out of the way. Oh, gets stuck into the corner. Gracie alley -oop. There it is. Things are not looking good for Mr. Amazing here. Into the pit. What? Oh, no. One count, Mr. Amazing. Somehow. 
Finding that mustard. Oh, and he tricks him there. Now going out after Owen Steele, but Owen Steele grabs a bat from him. Into the gut. Oh, and right against the back. Oh, and onto the leg. And now a DDT. Now sends him into the barricade. Reversal. We're getting some cool overhead shots by our cameraman. Kind of making me feel a little dizzy. Now, look at the strength there. He's dropping his gut over his knee. Oh, into the post, my goodness. What is going on with the camera? I don't know. Dropping the elbow. Owen's oh, still breaking out of the hold of Mr. Amazing. Now sends Mr. Amazing back into the ring. Mr. Amazing back up. Oh, Jesus. Oh, nice suplex. Now bring in the strikes. The crowd firmly behind Mr. Amazing at this moment. Oh, but gets dumped to the outside. And he is looking for something under the ring. Another light tube. Oh, Mr. Amazing does not want another one of those. That's for damn sure. Oh, it still has him up. Oh, off the hardest part of the ring. Sending him back into the ring now. Mr. Amazing fighting back into the pit. One, two, and a kick out. Here we go. He's looking to lock up into the arm bar. Will Owen still tap here? No, he does not. He fights out of the hold. On the ropes now. He's trying to rip the arm out of the socket. And still continues to work on that arm. Pounding away. Oh, and still bringing up the outside, and Mr. Amazing have a little fun. Runs right into a knee by Owen Steele. Mr. Amazing with a flying forearm. Oh, but into the roll up. One, two. Oh, he almost gets it there. Oh, runs into the ref. Giving Mr. Amazing the opening he needs. Kick to the gut. Amazingly stunned. One, two, three. And he continues his reign here tonight. This man is a real workhorse. He literally spent 
the evening last night on Dragon's Den Wrestling, winning a gauntlet match where he beat, I want to say, three other opponents, and now retains the hardcore title. And now for the main event, our women's champion, for Samaya Jones. The crowd, the heroes cry. I'm in the spot, I legends never die. That's those rocks from Memphis, that's in where. In the cage, no room to spare. Heroes fall, and villains rise. And she's really looking like she's got the physique and the toughness in her. You gotta believe that she's gonna draw comparisons to the lady that won gold for boxing at the Paris Olympics. Both very strong women. Where the mystery serves. We ain't here for cheers. Magic madness. We play on your fears. No Represented. No Just misfits. the sounds we are playing. On the side of the Maya Aldo. Marcus Green. Men to understand. I'm Maya Aldo. Aldo breaks the norm with tricks so cool and wild. I made ourselves find every day. I scream. This is a big opportunity for her here tonight. Hello, Rock. Greetings from America. And right away, Amelia going on the, Amaya, sorry, Amaya going on the attack here. You as well, Rock. Nice to meet you as well. And a springboard moonsault. Beautifully done. Now off the ropes here. Oh, no, Omega catches her. Omega is right now one of our highest rated wrestlers. So Amaya definitely has her work cut off for her here tonight. Oh, getting a little combo going. Yeah, it's um, it's all created wrestlers. Yeah, um, if you have a wrestler you want to add, you just have to tell me where to go to download it. Or put the hashtag for your wrestler VCWA. I'll even create entrance music for it. Into the bear hug here.
Throwing her back in the ring now. Uh, I don't. Uh, just Facebook and uh, YouTube as well as Twitch. It's all under VCWA for life. You can message me on Facebook if you want to, like, tell me a little backstory on your wrestler. Or you can leave in the comments here. Either way. One, two. It is all created wrestlers. I use AI to help me make theme songs for everybody. No, not even one count there. Oh, and she is really working over Omega here. And yet again, continues to bring her pain. Big knee to the face. Now pounding away. Here we go. Oh, nobody home. Big back body drop. Off the top rope there, neck first. Amaya rolls out of the way. Now we're back in the corner. Oh, just tossed away. Oh, boy. This does not look good. There's the headbutt. It's not as forgiving as you would think. We got to a count of three, but Omega brought her back in. Another massive headbutt. Oh, misses somehow. Ripcord, and there it is. She's finished many matches with that. One, two, three. We're having a little stare down here. Oh, we know what she wants. Isabella Torres coming down to let her know. She is looking for a title shot. Isabella Torres and Omega Fisher got into a stare down the ring, putting the crowd in uproar over the anticipation of these two superstars in a title match. Both competitors have shown they're taking this championship match seriously, promising an intense bout between the two rivals. And we'll end the show on that great match. Thank you all for joining us. We have uh, Monday Morning Madness at 6 a.m. on Monday, exclusively on YouTube. And then we'll be right back here on Twitch, Tuesday night at 7. 
for Tuesday night action. Thank you for joining me. I am Richie Richardson, your favorite announcer, and I will see you on Tuesday. Have a good night.